welcome back to my channel. In this video, I thought I will glam up my friend. You guys have seen her before. If you haven't, we've already filmed a video together about skincare. I'm gonna link it right here. Definitely go and check it out. Do you like your makeup? I think you're officially hired. <laughs> <laughs> so I have never done somebody's makeup before, and I was really nervous before I decided to do this. But I was really excited because I definitely wanted to try it out. I wanted to try putting makeup on other people because I do makeup on this face so many times. So I was like, let's do someone else now. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> Let's do it in the face. <laughs> yeah, I think I did an okay job. No, I think so, you've done a fabulous job. Thank you so much. And thank you so much for being on my channel. I had a lovely time filming this video. It was so much fun. It took a long time to say the least. I think it took us like two to three hours to film this video. <laughs> three hours, guys. We're not kidding. Yeah, three hours. Three hours to film this video but I'm so happy with the result and I'm so happy that you like your makeup so yeah if you guys want to know how we created this glam right here definitely stay tuned and keep on watching so we are going to start by toning her skin and I'm going to use the Kama Ayurveda rose water spray for that And now I'm telling her to pat it into her skin because you always want to prep your skin before you do your makeup and you want to make sure you really pat it in place. Now I'm going to move on to serum and I'm going to use the Laneige Water Bank Hydro Essence. And I'm really going to massage it into her skin because you want to massage your serums and moisturizers in place. Now I'm going to take the Revitalizing Moisturizing Cream from the face shop. This is great for combination skin and makeup sits beautifully on top of this. Now I'm going to massage this in place and help improve the blood circulation. Now I'm going to have her apply her own eye cream. Now I'm going to use the LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade orange to correct her skin tone. Now for foundation, I'm going to use the NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. It has amazing coverage and it's great for all skin types. And we skipped primer on purpose because we don't really need it after this much skincare prep and also because it's 12, 12 a.m. and we're not going anywhere after this and we're just doing this for fun so we don't really need primer right now. And you always want to make sure you take it down the neck as well. Now for concealer, I'm going to use the Tarte Shape Tape. And to really get in that inner corner, I'm going to use a brush. Now for baking, I'm going to use the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. And I'm not baking with it, I'm just setting the entire face because I don't want to dry out the skin too much. Now we just did this eyebrow off camera and I'm going to do that eyebrow and I'm using her eyebrow pencil. This is the NYX Micro Brow Pencil. It is one of my favourites as well. So we're just going to brush them out with the spoolie first and I'm just going to follow the natural shape of her brows. Now I'm going to take the pack eyebrow palette and I'm going to mix these two shades to further define the brow. So for eye makeup, I'm going to start with my favorite palette in the entire world. This is the Huda Coral Obsessions palette. The shades in this palette are absolutely beautiful and I'm going to start with this yellow shade right here. And I'm going to keep this shade in the upper crease area. I'm actually going to switch to the NYX Fire palette because she wants something orangey. So I could have taken the yellow from this palette as well. So I'm going to take the orange from this palette now. And now I'm switching to a Sigma E25. Going back to the yellow shade, I'm just going to help blend everything up. 
top because blending is the key to everything and I'm gonna keep switching between the colors and keep layering them now I'm gonna switch to the soft glam palette and I'm gonna take a little bit of rustic going back to the orange because I want to keep that orange really there I'm gonna go to the shade Cypress Umber now Now I'm going to take the Tarte Chrome Paint Shadow Pot in the shade Park Avenue Princess and this is going all over the lid. I'm going back to Rustic and helping blend the shimmer into the outer corner. Now I'm going to take Noir from the same palette on a Sigma winged liner brush. Now I'm just going to trace that line with a liquid liner. Now I'm going to have her curl her eyelashes. Now I'm just applying mascara on her lashes. For lashes, I'm going to use these pack lashes. These are in style 213. Okay, so both of the top lids are done and I'm going to have her apply her own kajal in her lower lash line now. I'm going to use the shade Rustic again to help smudge the lower lash line. Now I'm using the orange shade from the fire palette again just to help smudge the lower lash line further. Now to moisturize the lips, I'm using my current favorite lip balm. This is the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I'm gonna bronze the skin now and I'm using the NARS Laguna Bronzer for that. For the nose contour, I'm using the Kiko Smart Contouring Palette. I'm gonna take the Kat Von D shade in Light Powder and I'm gonna mix both of these shades. Now I'm gonna clean up her contour to enhance the bronzer. And I'm not gonna keep it on too long because I don't wanna bake, I just wanted to clean up the contour. For blush, I'm gonna use MAC Peaches. And I don't like to smile to apply blush because when you smile, smile a little bit, your apple is right there. But when you stop smiling, your apple comes down. So you want to apply your blush just a little bit above your actual apple. For highlighter, I'm going to use one of my favorites. This is MAC O Darling. and also underneath the brow bone. Now I'm gonna set the brows using the Benefit Gimme Brow. Now I'm gonna line the lips using the pack Precisionist Lip Liner. This is in the shade Soft Spoken. It's a beautiful orangey peachy color.
I'm gonna take the Faces Lip Crayon in the shade Wrapped Up and I'm gonna apply it straight from the bullet because this is her own. Now I'm gonna set the entire face with the pack Micro Finish Makeup Fixer. Now I'm also just gonna apply a little bit of highlighter on her collarbones and the shoulders. So this is the final result. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. What do you think? <laughs> she has no thoughts. <laughs> so I think she's done a fabulous job guys. Uh, so one of my friends wedding is coming up in July and this was a trial run. I think you're officially hired Ashara, like I said before. Let's do this again on your channel, for sure. Oh yeah, definitely. I want to keep trying different makeup looks because this is like my kind of glam. You guys know I love working with warm tones and bronzes and peaches. So I could have done like transforming my best friend into me tag, but I didn't want to do that because I wanted to try it out and see how it works out because this is the first time I'm putting makeup on someone else. And you have no idea how long it took uh, for both of us to really convince ourselves to do this but I think I think we've done a fabulous job yes. yeah yeah yes. you were so good as well it was really easy putting makeup on her as well because she was so patient and just sitting there for two hours <laughs> doing nothing with a Red Bull can which you guys didn't see yeah <laughs> So, oh, we have another Red Bull. Mm. Mm. And I've realized that when you're putting makeup on other people, you don't really want to glam up yourself. So I'm sitting here with my most basic AF makeup on. And I didn't want to glam myself up because I, I was like, if I start glamming myself up, then I'm going to take two hours. And yeah. then her makeup is going to take three hours. And then we're going to be here forever. So basically, yeah, she's <laughs> just lazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned some new tricks here and there. Definitely let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Like like this video if you enjoyed and if you want to see more Super such like. videos and I definitely love to create more videos like this. Do you want to see more makeup looks? Of course. So you just keep doing it. Yeah, she also wanted orangey glam so we yes. did an orangey glam today but so I definitely want to play with more color because as you guys know I love playing with color on my channel as well. So I want to do some more colorful makeup looks on you in the future and yeah please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Click the little red subscribe button down there and also click the bell next to the subscribe button so you're notified whenever I have a new video up and if you want to see some behind the scenes and more pictures and my fashion and all of that definitely check out my Instagram. The link is going to be down below and yeah I think we should go now. It's 3.30 a.m. right now. I really need need to take this off. Yeah, I think wash this off sadly. Yeah, it is so sad. So, so sad. Yeah, let's just go and wash our faces off and apply or some just face sleep masks. With this. No, don't sleep with this. Your makeup will be on my pillow then. Ah. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching you guys. I'm going to see you super soon in my next one. Bye! Bye.